Hello guys, today we will learn about Hasidic talk. So we have written disclaimer. It means this should be in mind that if you are piercing the skin, you should go with the needle attached to the syringe and there should be negative suction in it. Now aseptic tap. I would like to say that before doing aseptic tap, we will infiltrate lignocaine local anesthesia two percent just before putting the needle. The infiltration of lignocaine is not seen in the video, but yeah, we will infiltrate first lignocaine, then we will start the tap. Okay, this is the position. It should be slightly up. <coughs> I mean, head is slightly up. Okay. First of all, we would like to define the situs. A situs can be defined as the accumulation of free fluid in the peritoneal cavity. Let us see the video. After that, we'll explain the situs indications and the procedure steps. Okay. This is the area from where the aseptic tap is going to be started. So we will first clean it all around in a circular manner. After cleaning it, we will obviously infiltrate the local anesthesia. After that, we will take the cannula. We have taken the green cannula. We will go either we stretch the abdominal skin that will make the entrance Z or we simply go using Z technique from the beginning. Okay, you see the you see this area that we will go first parallel to the horn in the subcutaneous tissue area and skin. Then we'll go perpendicular to the wall. And in the end, we'll go again parallel to the wall when we reach in the abdomen. Okay, after we reach in the abdomen, we should have gone by a syringe attached to the cannula so that we could appreciate if there is any puncture of vessel. Okay, now we are. Checking it. Now we yeah, are. The fluid is coming out. We will take out twenty five to fifty ml of acetic fluid and we will send it for different examinations I will show you in this slide ok I will take one more syringe and this is the diagnostic aseitic tap this is finished if we wanted to do a diagnostic tap but if we want to do a therapeutic tap this is the continuation for it we will attach a three way cannula First of all, we will close it. Okay. Now, we will connect it to the IV set. Which in turn is connected to a 500 normal saline bottle. Now we will open this and decompress the abdomen in case the patient is symptomatic. In this case the patient was having breathlessness due to massive ascites. We have taken out 1 liter of ascitic fluid from this patient. Now. You should know the causes of ascites. These are 
cirrhosis of liver may be one of the cause, may be malignant ascites. Malignant ascites means a patient of malignancy developing ascites. Kidney disease like a nephrotic syndrome can also lead to ascites. Heart failure can lead to ascites. Pancreatitis can also lead to ascites. Tuberculosis will lead to ascites and malnutrition definitely a cause of ascites. Now, there is International Ascetic Club grading for the grading of ascites. In this, we classify ascites as grade 1 when the ascites is mild and detectable on USG only. Grade 2 is moderate ascites in which symmetrical abdominal distension is there. In grade 3, cross ascites with marked abdominal distension is there. Okay, indications of ascitic tap are if you want to do diagnostic test, in this small, uh, small quantity is removed from the abdomen for the analysis. In this, the indications are non serotic patient developing ascites of recent onset, just to know the cause. In therapeutic, large quantity is removed, maybe 1 liter or 1.5 liter. <coughs> In this, the large quantity is removed to reduce intra-abdominal pressure. Like if the patient is having abdominal pain due to ascites or dyspnea due to ascites. Now, the position is, this is the position. This is what? So, find with head up. Left lower quadrant is the site where we do ascitic tap. Right side may have dilated cecum, so we should avoid it. The position is 3 cm medial and 2 cm above the anterior fibrillary ilex spine. You should avoid surgical scar to avoid injury to the model. Obviously, we will avoid vessels to avoid bleeding. That is why I told you in the beginning, go with the syringe attached with a negative suction. The procedure is, okay, first we clean the area. Oh, before that, we should take the consent of the patient because this is the invested procedure. No nil per oral, oral is required. Then we should mark the area. After that, we should sterilize the skin with spirit or betadine. Then we apply 2% local anesthesia using Z technique. <coughs> the Z technique causes a non linear path which requires chances of leakage. Sorry, which reduces the chances of leakage. <coughs> okay, simply you can just pull the wall of the abdomen and this will make the path non-linear that is simply pull all a, an abdominal wall or simply enter through chest uh, jet technique which creates a non-linear path we have seen we have gone in the abdomen through Z technique now go in with the negative suction change the site if blood is aspirated obviously go until the fluid is aspirated in diagnostic Ascitic tap, 25 to 50 ml of fluid is removed and sent for malignant cytology, fluid for biochemistry, sent for gram stain and acid fast bacilli. It is also sent for ADA, fluid for culture and sensitivity, and SAAV. I'll explain what is SAAZ. It is serum ascites albumin gradient. Now, if it is high, when it is said it is high, when it is more than 1.1 gram per deciliter. High SAG is seen in cirrhosis, CHF, Bartschieri syndrome, and a low SAG is seen in tuberculosis, peritoneal carcinomatosis, pancreatitis, and the nephrotic syndrome. High SAAG means the serum protein is more than the ascitic protein, and the low SAG. AG means the serum protein is less than the ascitic protein. In therapeutic one, do not decompress all the fluid at a time. Obviously, you should know this. Supplement with the intravenous fluid and decompress to relieve the symptoms. Uh, two important points I'd like to tell you. Flank dullness present when at least 1.5 liter of fluid is present and when the fluid increases, shifting dullness and fluid thrill also can be elicited. Thank you so much. We will meet next time with some MCQ.